Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. From this video, we are going to start building our own Android application. So I am very excited to teach you. Are you excited? Let's begin. So to getting started with, we need Android Studio. So for downloading Android Studio, you have to came his official site. Okay. So you will got this download button. So click on that download button and it will ask you to accept some term and condition to so click on that term and condition accept button and click on this download button and once you click that it will ask you where you want to save that file so give him some specific location so in my case i am going to save this file inside my download and once it finishes you just have double click on the setup and it will start installing the android studio so it's not complicated you just have to follow the instructions android studio will guide you how you have to install that file and one more thing it will ask you to set up sdk so don't ignore that that is mandatory because sdk means software development kit so all the development environment and stuff comes with that uh, sdk so don't ignore that and follow how android studio will guide you and once you done with installation you will got this screen okay to create a new project so let's begin from here so click on this new project and select this empty activity and click next and here as you can see it will asking you for your project name so give your project name here and don't worry about this package name and here as you can see it will saying that your project will be going to be saved on this location so if you want to save on another location so click on that folder icon and give him the specific path once it's done he will get that path location here and leave rest of the stuff you don't have to worry about that click on that finish button and once you click that finish button it will start downloading required library and once you are done with downloading gradle and it will done all the setup stuff you will get this screen here as you can see we have two kotlin functions here okay and one class which is main activity so you don't have to worry about this for now let's run it and see what we got i assume that you don't have any android device so let's create a brand new emulator to run this code follow me on the top right corner you will got this device manager icon click on that okay and here you got a plus icon click on this plus icon and you will got a pop-up which is create virtual device click on that and it will asking you to select your required device so click on pixel 2 and you can go with your system specification but i recommend you to go with pixel 2 that is enough and click on that next it will ask you to download this hxn file this is important to run your code inside the emulator so don't ignore it install it on clicking on that it will ask you to specify some RAM. the recommended ram is 2gb so if you have only 4gb inside your uh, device don't worry about that go with 2gb and if you have a high-end device you can you can select whatever you want and once you've done that click on this finish icon it will start downloading the required uh, library and stuff and once it's done it's set up you will got your device name here on the top okay that means you are ready to build your first android application so you have to click on this play button that means this will start building your project so in my case i already have an android device so i am going to connect that device with android studio so i will guide you how you can connect your android device too so open your android setting and go inside about phone and in my case on clicking of miui version the seven time you will got the developer option inside this additional setting and here you need to enable this to so turn on this developer option and after that you have to enable this usb debugging and install via usb you need to enable all these settings and after that you are ready to install your android application inside this device so let's run our first application so before uh, running our application i'm going to change android okay let's run wait for some time at the first time it will take some time and it will also depend on your system so wait for some time and it will build all the code and launch it inside your android device 
ओके सो एज यू कैन सी हियर यू विल गो आउट हेलो एंड्रॉइड हो लेट मी चेंज इट हेलो गाइस एंड यू डोंट हैव टू री रन दिस एप्लीकेशन ओके इट विल ऑटोमेटिकली रिफ्लेक्ट द चेंजेस इन साइड योर एंड्रॉइड एप्लीकेशन सो एज यू कैन सी हियर हेलो गाइस सब्सक्राइब टू माय चैनल ओके एज यू कैन सी हियर विद द एक्सएमएल वी फर्स्ट डिजाइन आवर होल यूआई एंड आफ्टर दैट वी बाइंड दैट यूआई विद आवर कॉटलिन क्लास and after that we run that application and then we see the changes but in jetpack compose case hot reloading is changing the game okay as you can see here we don't have to rerun our application so this is the beauty of jetpack compose and there are lots of stuff comes with jetpack compose okay so i am very excited to teach you if you are excited and new on this channel click on that subscribe button and turn on the bell icon one more important update my whatsapp channel group link inside the description make sure you join that because at some time youtube will not send my video notification to you on time okay so i will notify whenever i post any video on my youtube channel in that group so make sure to join that group and if you enjoyed this uh, lecture hit that thumbs up button so youtube will recommend this video to other okay and that will motivate me to 